Hello there, it is I, the Jordy Nerd, and I am back again with another episode of Death Note. Episode 5. In the last episode, he found out that FBI agent's name, and now he's going to kill him. Which I think is quite stupid, because then it's going to point the direction to light uh, as being the killer. But, I mean, there's been a few shocks each episode, so I'm bound to be shocked in this one. I'm very, very excited to continue on with this. And if you're watching this on YouTube and you're enjoying it, please do share it around. Try and help get more eyes on it. I'm going to do more um, anime after this. I think the Cowboy Bebop was was one of those. And um, yeah, just just keep commenting animes to, to, to watch and share this around with your friends who love anime. That would be greatly appreciated. And to the people on the Patreon, of course, thank you for your support. I do appreciate it. It's $2 a month for unlimited reactions. So if you're not on there and you fancy unlimited reactions, then definitely go check that out. But yeah, let's just get this now and have some fun. You there. Yeah? Listen carefully. I came to Japan as part of a secret investigation so the local police can't find out that, um, that I... Oh, I don't think it's going to matter soon, mate. It's just as I thought. Anyway, I don't want the police to know that I've come into contact with an FBI agent either. If my father ever found out, there's no doubt he'd let Elle know. It's obvious that he doesn't... But I mean, surely Elle knows. So you were already riding the bus when the hijacker got on? Yeah. And in the end, the guy freaked out, jumped off the bus and got hit by a car. Did he die? Yeah, probably. I couldn't really stick around to see what happened to him. You know... So, how's he gonna die? Coincidence, don't you think? What do you mean? Think about it. You got on that bus because you were investigating someone, right? And now you're telling me that this criminal is most likely dead. Doesn't that suggest that you... That's enough. <laughs> Look, darling, you and I know you used to be one of the best agents in the FBI. So maybe you should listen to her then. Oh, let me guess. You're about to write down the name of that agent, aren't you? The one from the bus. Not yet. I'm going to wait one week before writing his name. If he dies right after meeting me, I'll only draw attention to myself. Yeah, I suppose. Uh, Small-ish. Mr. Ray Penber. Turn around and you're dead. I am Kira. That's right. Don't turn around or... Wow. I mean, could you not just tell who it is? I'm sure you care more about your loved ones than any of these people here. Imagine how you'd feel if one of them was killed just because you refused to cooperate. I think you should consider them the real hostages at the moment. How do you know about her? No way. He's going to make him choose somebody or... He kills his partner. I'll be close by at all times, which means I'll be watching your every move. When you get on the train, pick a spot in front of you and don't take your eyes off it. If I see you looking around, I will kill you. Once you've boarded, I want you to take the seat closest to the doors. If it's occupied, wait until it's free. Oh, it's really tense. Really tense. What is the meaning of this? What is he after? Let's face it, he hasn't really left me any choice. Besides, it's not like he can kill them using just their names. Next, take out your laptop and turn it on. Any minute now, your boss is going to send you a message with a file attachment. It contains the names and photos of all the FBI agents currently active in Japan. But this... this is... Now, one by one, you're going to look at each photo and then write that agent's name in the space provided. You're going to do this for each agent. It doesn't make sense. Oh, he's, got, he's definitely got him. He's screwed. After that, you're going to stay in your seat and ride the train for at least another 30 minutes. When you are absolutely certain that nobody will notice you leaving without the envelope, you can get off the train. I mean, he's a smart serial killer, isn't he, Light? Kira, who are you? <gasps> no, he did, he killed him! <sighs> like, Yagami. Farewell, Ray Penber. 
Holy shit. I mean, he's just an FBI agent. He's not a criminal in any way. And he's killed him. I mean, he said he was going to, and I don't know why I'm so shocked, but come on. And the other 11 investigators, <laughs> they all died of heart attacks after receiving the same file. That is, that is insane. I, ca I cannot believe he's just... Ca They're not the bad guys, Light. You are the bad guy now. You are a criminal. I mean, you were when you killed the criminals, but still, you're even worse now. I felt that it was necessary to uncover Kira's identity. I cannot accept that. I find it unbelievable that you would spy on us. The very people working with you on this case. Hear that? Well, I knew all along we couldn't trust that guy. More importantly, Kira killed those FBI agents, didn't he? It's obvious he'll kill anyone who gets in his way, whether they're criminals or not. Yep, time to quit. Time to quit. Do you know gods of death? Love apples. Damn you, Kira. I love how quickly it's just gone to just straight murder and everyone. No, he was... He was murdered by Kira. I hope she finds him. Ellen, her team up and get him. I don't want you to be alarmed. I'm sure you've heard of this Kira investigation. Well, I'm currently in charge of it. What? Are you serious? That's totally awesome, Dad. You're the best cop ever. That's not quite <laughs> the point I'm trying. It's a very happy kid, this one. I think it's honorable of you, Dad. I'm proud to be able to call you my father. And if anything should ever happen to you, I'm going to find Kira. And make sure he gets executed. I mean, I don't think he's going to kill his dad. But... That is all. So... What are you gonna do? I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, that's him, all right. There's no doubt about it. I remember him because he told us to get down, but I don't really remember any of the other passengers. I see. Well, thanks for talking with me anyway. I appreciate it. Yeah, I think she's gonna be the one to bring him into the light of day. <laughs> well, her and L. L. If all of us are going to work together on this investigation, and if you truly meant what you said about trusting the six of us, could you come here so we can all meet in person? The thought had already crossed my mind. After all, I did say that I trusted all of you. Or, you could take another way. They're all working with him. And now they get to see your face. I agree. Excuse From me? From the beginning. He's been very upfront about the fact that he would need the help of the police on this case. Perhaps we should think of it like he's been waiting for this to happen all along. Why would he do something like that? There were a number of people on the task force who distrusted L before this investigation began. And once we got started, we had detectives resigning left and right. Following that, classified information was leaked. So I'm not surprised that he didn't trust us. In other words, he was waiting for the task force to get narrowed down to only those investigators he could trust. And to do that, he needed to weed out anyone who wasn't totally committed. Hmm. Very smart and cunning. Only a matter of time before we collide. So be it. I'm ready to show my face. I'll make my first public appearance as L. If you ever manage to find out about these secret meetings, I'm sure you'd feel compelled to move in. That's what I'm counting on. I've been quite active over these last few days. Think carefully. Was there anything I missed? And what comes next? There are endless possibilities. The real battle is only just beginning. It's unlocked. Please, let yourselves in. Mm. Well, I guess we'll find out what L looks like properly in the next episode. Love it. The love tease, don't they? Oh, it's like a cheap stripper. <laughs> but yeah, that was, that was good. He's just killing anyone who stands in his way. So he's becoming... I mean, to kill someone immediately, you you are a bad person. Do you know what I mean? 
Like, unless it's self-defense or, you know, someone's breaking into your house. You know what I mean. Like, he's just murdering folk. And now, he's just murdering normal people. So, yeah. Bit shitty, isn't it? So, yeah, I'm really enjoying this. Thank you as ever for coming out. And I do, do truly appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, more Death Note coming soon. Hopefully more on YouTube and definitely on Patreon. So, yeah, if you want to see the full unedited reactions, check out that. And if you're on Patreon already, you're awesome. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'll see you all again very soon for more Death Note reaction videos.